These are installation instructions for accessory number 11560 work light kit. Check the carton contents with the inventory list. Tools required for installation. Step 1, see figure 1. Drill holes and plastic top to mount work lights. Measure and mark holes 4 inches from both edges of the top. Drill a 3 8 hole 1 inch from the top of the lip. Drill a quarter inch hole 3 8 of an inch above the top of the lip. Step 2, see figure 2. Attach light to the plastic top. Insert the wire into the quarter inch hole, remove the nut and washer from the light and insert the 3 8 inch light bolt into the hole. Place the large ring end of one of the white ground wires over the light bolt. Add the washer and then the nut. Run the nut down on the bolt but do not tighten at this time. Step 3, see figure 3A and 3B. Install the switch and secure the light. Install the light switch into the large hole in the switch bracket. Attach the bracket to either the right or left tab on the top frame. Place the small ring terminal of the white ground wire over the bolt and add a nut. Run the white ground wire to the hole in the gusset for larger 40,000 series tops. Tighten all bolts at this time. Step 4, C Figure 4. Attach the wiring harness and power supply wire. Connect the female spade terminal of the wiring harness to one of the switch terminals. Connect the female plug end of the harness to the lights. 
Connect the female spade terminal of the power supply wire to the other switch terminal. C figure 5. Place the wires in the corrugated loom. Cut a length of loom long enough to cover the wire harness between the lights. Press the wires into the split along the side. Secure in place with the cable ties provided. Cut a length of loom long enough to cover the power supply wire. Secure in place with cable ties provided. Run the power supply wire along the frame to keep the battery secure. it with the cable ties to keep it away from moving or hot parts of the machine. Step 6. Connect power wire to the battery. Disconnect the negative battery cable, disconnect the positive battery cable, and place the ring terminal of the power wire over the positive battery terminal bolt. Replace the bolt and nut, and then tighten. Reconnect the negative battery terminal. 